Lewis Hamilton will race in the 2020 Abu Dhabi Grand Prix after being vacant for one race as he tested positive for COVID-19 and sat out of the Sake Grand Prix. The seven-time world champion is now back in his Mercedes W11 car and he will race in the Twilight Race in Abu Dhabi, the final round of the 2020 Formula 1 season. So yes, as I've just said there, a week ago heading into the second race in Bahrain, the Sake Grand Prix, Lewis Hamilton unfortunately tested positive for coronavirus, COVID-19. Then George Russell, the British driver from Williams, who was a Mercedes junior driver in 2018 and a Budden driver to take the W11 seat uh, at Mercedes in the future, stepped up to the plate and replaced Lewis Hamilton alongside Valtteri Bottas in that race. Now, it was looking incredibly good for him. He topped both Friday sessions. He got a P2, the front row position, and the Mercedes 1-2 in qualifying in the Saturday. But after a poor and bad strategy from Mercedes, a tyre pit stop error, it unfortunately left George Russell just getting inside the point. And a phenomenal drive, but it meant that he had a pretty bad position, just scoring a few minor points and obviously not a podium. And even a race win, which of course a lot of people thought that he could. He won drive of the day. Even though it wasn't a good position, nevertheless, we thought it was very good on track. Much better than Bartley Bottas and showing that he has very good racecraft in that W11 car. It was looking like George Russell would be racing for Mercedes in the W11 at the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. He did the Thursday press comments just earlier today and looks like he would be in the car for practice. And that would cement himself in for the weekend. But it has come out that Lewis Hamilton has done everything to basically pass and get his way into racing in Abu Dhabi. Now, to race in the United Arab Emirates, he had to have four negative coronavirus tests, of which Lewis Hamilton has been able to do. The isolation from the Bahrain, from the second Bahrain race, the Kia Grand Prix, has worked very well for him, and it means that he'll be able to get back into his car and race in Yaz Marina. Now, firstly, it is incredible news for Lewis Hamilton. We've had drivers who have tested positive for coronavirus, but have obviously bounced back after possibly missing a race, maybe even two, in, of course, this very long, hectic, 17-race COVID-filled uh, calendar that we have had so far. It is good to see that Lewis Hamilton has, of course, recovered from this, and it will be good to see him back in the race, of course, uh, trying to further extend his result. I think he can get to 99 podium uh, pole positions this weekend, which is absolutely incredible feat. He would have got to 100 if he'd actually completely in the bar in the second race in bar in the Sakia Grand Prix well of course and of course got a pole position as well which his teammate Valtteri Bottas did amazing news for Lewis Hamilton as well even though George Russell did a good position in that Mercedes he will be now reverting back to Williams but after a good strong result with his you know a promising future team in Sakia it will be good for him to return back to Williams with the node that he has driven the fastest known car in Formula 1 and most likely the fastest car in Formula 1 history ever and of course it will be good to know that this is where he f he might end up in the future it is good for him as well again knowing that he can of course beat Valtteri Bottas uh, and put up a very good fight in the race where he jumped him into corner one as well and of course some amazing results uh, amazing overtakes in the race last Sunday but Lewis Hamilton will be taking back his seat he'll be racing in Yas Marina and of course the la uh, last year's winner and a man who has won at the Yas Marina track a lot of times in his career both Mercedes and with McLaren it is looking for look good for Lewis Hamilton into this weekend in Abu Dhabi so we hope that you are happy with this news it is great to see Lewis Hamilton back in the car again the seven time world champion it's been an incredible year for him and as we now sit on the verge of him getting knighted and also him being nominated for Spurs Sports Personality of the Year award it is looking good for him to hopefully go out in Yas Marina for one last time in 2020 and put on an amazing show for us it is unfortunate for George Russell but nevertheless it has been a good run for him and that also means that Jack Aiken the Korean driver who stepped in to of course replace George Russell alongside Canadian driver Nick Satifi will be now stepping back again a good position from him a very good race from him showing his worth in the Mercedes car of course a man that you know we um, uh, we've met here on the F1 debate show. So it is good to see him, but obviously that he will be stepping back. George Russell will be stepping back into the Williams car and Lewis Hamilton will be stepping back into his Mercedes. Hope that you are happy with this. Let us know in the comment section below. And also what do you think the result will be? We have a prediction league over on Twitter as well, so please go and enter that if you haven't already. And I'll say let us know your comments below for your predictions and how well do you think Lewis Hamilton will do this weekend. And also when we'll be seeing George Russell back in that car in the future. Thank you very much for watching this breaking news video. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe. We have so much more content coming your way throughout uh, well, this weekend, the last weekend, the off-season and, of course, 2021, including our race reaction, which will be coming to you by me on Sunday afternoon.
after the race. So catch us when that comes out. Like and subscribe, hit the notification bell to be notified every time we upload. We are also over on SoundCloud as well, so if you have SoundCloud, please go and give us a follow over there. Thank you very much for watching this Britain News video. Stay safe. We hope that you enjoy the race in Abu Dhabi. And until next time, guys, we'll see you later.